Smurfs, gather around. Today, we have work to do on the bridge, so why don't you all get started? And I'll be along in a few minutes. Cozy corner and lazy smirk. Where are you going? Oh, uh, I'll, I'll get back to work now, like everyone else. Yes, Papa Smurf. Oh, these Smurfs, they wear me out. Hello, Hefty. How's it going? Oh, fine, Papa Smurf. Uh, could you toss me a shovel? Here you go. Ooh. Whose shovel is this? Oh, that's mine, Papa Smurf. You, Papa Smurf, don't you just love it? I picked the color all by myself. With your eyes open or closed? Very humorous, Papa Smurf. I always say that Papa Smurf is a very humorous Smurf indeed. Oh! My nerves can't take much more of this. Oof! Lazy Smurf, go out in the forest and cut some logs, lots of logs, and move it! Why aren't these Smurfs easier to live with? They're driving me stark, raving Smurfy! Oh, my first log! Smurf sure is taking his sweet time coming back. He's probably loafing on the job, Papa Smurf. In fact... Never mind, Brady. Just go find him. Yes, Papa Smurf. Lazy, where are you? Get up! Get up, get up! Get up! Yay! Get up. Papa Smurf! Papa Smurf! Get up, get up! Lazy's over there, but he's all purple, and all he says is, Gnap! Lazy's always talking about a nap. Like this? Gnap! Yay! This is terrible. Lazy must have been bitten by a purple fly. A purple fly? Oh, there he is! Gnap! 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 He's headed for the village! Catch him! This way! Stop that smurf! Gnap! Gnap! Poor Lazy. Can Take him to his house. Can I, can I? The last case of this was when I was only a young Smurfling, barely a hundred years old. And I can't remember what the cure was. Proper formula to help poor Lazy. Yeah. Ow! A purple smurf bit me. He, he. Get up! 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 Great smurf! It's catching. Everyone out! I must discover a cure before it's too late. Wake up, Smurfs! I think I found the cure. But to test it, we must catch a purple Smurf. It will be dangerous. The purples are contagious. Are there any volunteers? Me! 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 Okay, let's split up and search every bush. Get out! Get out! Hey! I found one! Hey, I captured one single Smurf Idly. Oh, 
brainy. I had no idea you were so brainy. Ah, uh, Smurfette, it was my nothing. <laughs> okay, let's get started. Andy, pinch his tail. <laughs> He's still purple. Quickly, untie him and put him in bed. Poor Smurf. Yeah, it's enough to ruin your appetite. Yow! He bit me. Snap! Get away! Snap! Papa Smurf! Snap! Snap! Ow! This is a disaster. I must find another remedy. Smurfs, I hope this ointment will do the trick. But once again, I'll need volunteers to... Oh, so that's it. You, you, and you are elected. Now, Smurf to it. Yes, Papa Smurf. Good job, Smurfs. Now, buy the ointment. Smurfs, none of my remedies have worked, and time is running out. Fifteen Smurfs are infected now. Ow! And these at sixteen. Ow! Seventeen must be cured before we become extinct. Our last hope is to capture the dreaded purple fly. Perhaps we can learn from it what the cure is. Go, and good smurfing! Ah! Ow! Oh no, another one! Oh, we caught the purple fly! We caught it! Yay! Bye! Work 
cured! Yay! Oh, what a welcome sight you all are! Never again I complain about my dear little Smurfs. I love you all just as you are. And, and we, we love, love you too, Papa Smurf! I must find those miserable little Smurfs, Azriel. Find them and rid the forest of their nasty, rotten, wretched little blue hides once and for all. <laughs> If this creation of my sheer genius works, as it should, Azrael, I'll be able to find those horrible little Smurfs with no problem. <coughs> it's ready, Azrael. <coughs> now I'll find out exactly where those Smurfs are. Show me, oh magic crystal ball, where to find the most miserable creatures of all. <coughs> What's this? No, 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 I mean the Smurfs. Their village. But, but, but where are the Smurfs? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Dreamy. Happy birthday to you. Yay! I hate Smurf days. Not yet, me. Oh, make a wish and blow out the candles, Dreamy. I wish. I wish I could fly to a new world no Smurf has ever seen. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Here I go, flying to a strange new world. Ah, oh, I'd Smurf anything in the whole wide world to be a space traveler. Ah, oh, I got it. It's a smurfy wind and... Whoa! I, I can't! I'm flying! I'm flying! I'm not flying! Oh! That was a short break, but it was a smurfy landing! <laughs> Well, just keep on laughing because I'm going to fly to the stars yet. Mm. Well, to make flying broom, place broom on ground facing east. Then say loud and clear, Witchy, Coochie, Smoochie, Smurf. Hey, 
wish of flying to the stars will never come true. Oh, I'll never smurf to the stars. Never, ever, ever, ever. See, I wish I could help Dreamy. Hello. That's it, Smurfette. I'll build a ship to smurf into the stars. A flying ship. We're, we're getting closer, Azriel. I can feel it. The Smurfs are almost mine. <laughs> Ooh. Azriel, my crystal ball. <laughs> Ah, oh, my crystal ball. It, it's safe. It's safe. Get in, Harmony! Oh, I'm sorry. Hear ye! Hear ye! Uh, excuse me. <laughs> this is a Smurf boy. Astro Smurf announces the unveiling of his new flying ship. All Smurfs are invited to watch his Smurf Day wish come true when he Smurfs off to the stars. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, what do you think, Papa Smurf? Well, it's a very smurfy flying ship, Astro Smurf. But how does it work? Metal power, Papa Smurf. Pedals turn the propeller, which lifts the ship into the air, and Smurfs beat to the stars. A space waste. I predict it will never work. Never, never, never. Oh, Smurf up your face, me no brainy. Well, good luck, Astro Smurf. Have a safe trip. Goodbye! Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one! Smurf off! Yep, this is real nice spring. Yeah, this is real... Wait a minute, I hate nice breezes. <laughs> Smurf has hitched his wagon to a Smurf, and he'll never be happy until he can fly to the stars. But alas, that can never be. But that was his Smurf Day wish. Oh, yeah, and all Smurf Day wishes come true, don't they, Papa Smurf? Yes, that's been the way of the Smurfs for as long as I can remember. Which is exactly 543 years, right, Papa Smurf? Papa Smurf, we have to do something to make his wish come true. Yes, Smurfette. And I have an idea that might work. You really think my shirt will work now, Papa Smurf? Andy Smurf checked it over and fixed everything that was wrong. And I can Smurf up for the stars right now? Yes, but first you must take this special raspberry potion that will give you strength on your long journey. <laughs> Turning. Quick, send up the smoke clouds and start rocking the ship. Tell me, Clumsy, where were you when brains were handed out? Where was I? Uh, gee, uh, I don't know. M maybe I was with you, huh, Brain? <laughs> I hate smoke. My ship's moving. I'm Smurf Bob. I'm on my way to the What's going on? I feel so sleepy. Must be the altitude. Oh, I mustn't. It stopped. He's asleep. The raspberry potion worked. Hurry, get Astro Smith out of there and let's take the ship apart. <laughs> The flying ship is all apart, Papa Smurf. What do we do with the pieces? Tomorrow, we take them to a secret spot whose whereabouts only I, Smurf. Oh, goody Smurf drop. I love secret spots. <laughs> Add four grains of euphoria with the boiling juice of the mandrake root. <sighs> now to try it out. Oh, the formula works! Oh, oh, oh. the Smurfs can only see me now! Oh. There they are. 
they are again, Azriel. Don't they look good enough to eat? <laughs> Come on, we won't lose them this time. <laughs> Is it much further, Papa Smurf? Not far now. Oh, my. How much further, Papa Smurf? Not far now. This isn't funny. How much further, Papa Smurf? Not far now. Is it much further, Papa Smurf? Yes, it is! But there's nothing but a volcano, Papa Smurf. And you always said, volcano, smurf, fire and smoke, and all kinds of terrible and nasty things. True, true. But this volcano is extinct. Oh, of course, extinct. Come on, let's get this smurf on the road. We have work to do. Rotten, disgusting smurfs crossed here, Azriel. Look at their revolting little footprints. Come on, they're within our grasp now. <laughs> Come on, Azriel. <coughs> oh, you miserable cat, Azriel. How dare you! Oh! One of these days, Azriel, I'm. I'm. Going to turn you into a cat fur pillow! Why do we have to smurf our brains out while sleeping Astro Smurf here sleeps? This is for the Smurfs. Wait a second, Grouchy! Do you know what's green, red, and yellow? With big eyes and long teeth? No, what? Oh, magic crystal ball, where are the most disgusting creatures of all? So, they're inside the old volcano. That's not far from here. And it's the perfect spot to finally put an end to those miserable little creatures. <laughs> when Astro Smurf wakens, he'll think he's on another planet. And we want to be ready, so... That's why I Smurf this magical potion that will turn us all into spoofs. Swoops? Uh, what's a swoop, Papa Smurf? I'll show you, Clumsy. This is a swoop. I'm Grandpa Swoop. Uh, where am I? Oh, I'm on another planet. Oh, oh, yeah! And look at him! He really thinks he's on another planet! <laughs> yeah, boy, is he dumb! I wonder where he was when the beans were handed out. <laughs> that means clumsy brains! Oh, yeah! Well, that's what I meant! Bean brain! Yeah, yeah! Wonder if anyone lives here! Guess that answer's that! Hiya! <laughs> Me, friend! Coming! Room, 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 room. Come meet Grandpa Swoof, King of all swoops. Say, uh, could you unhook my shorts first? That would be nice. Yeah. Where are you coming from? From a, a, a planet called Earth, Grandpa Swoop. Your friend or foe? Oh, me, big friend, big friend. Then we have council meeting and consider this. Stay here. Oh, I wonder what you're going to do to me. Excuse me. We're almost there, Azriel. We're almost there. Gargamel, we better tell Papa. Yeah, and is he going to be mad? Smurf, we have reached a decision. Oh? We decide you are friend. Welcome to Planet Swoof. Oh, thanks, Grandpa Swoop! Prepare feast to honor Astro Smurf! Yay! Boy, this sure is smurfy, Grandpa Swoop! I'm having a great time! You sleep 
soon. Need plenty strength to fly back to home planet tomorrow. Oh, but I'm never gonna fly back to Earth. <laughs> I wanna stay here forever. Forever? But well, you must go. Grandpa Smooth, Grandpa Smooth. <laughs> Where? Gar, take Astro Smurf to hut and don't let him out of sight. Gargamel is here. Astro Smurf mustn't see him, or he'll know he's still on Earth. But that's only half our worries. Astro Smurf likes the planet so much, he wants to stay here forever. I must think of a plan. I know they're nearby, Azrael. I can smell them. I can feel them. Let me see. What's this? Those aren't Smurfs. <laughs> How Gargamel found us, I don't know. But I think he's about to feel a bit under the weather. Help! My crystal ball! It's destroyed! Now I'll never find the Smurfs! Slimy lizard tongues. My seat is burnt to a crisp. I'm soaking wet, and my crystal ball is shattered. What else can go wrong? Something tells me Papa Smurf is behind this, Azriel. Azriel, get off my face! You, you mangy bag of fur! Let's get out of here! Yow! Now, to become spoof, you must prove courage and skill. Okay, but why do I have to smurf? After we spin you around, you must move spear right into that bullseye. What bullseye? I can't see a thing. It is the way of the spoof. For a second test, Astro Smurf, you must climb pole. I'm Smurf's taller in my time. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's right, a zillion years. I hate greased poles. Here I am. Huh? Ah, he's a Smurf. Hello, this pole isn't even greased. Isn't greased? Clumsy! Uh, oh, uh, I, I thought Greedy was gonna do that. Uh, yep, yeah, I did. Me? I thought Grouchy smurfed the pole. Uh, Lazy was gonna do it. You must now swim across lake. Okay, I'm a good swimmer. Carrying that rock. That rock? But that acts so smurfly impossible. You want to be swoop? You swim across the lake with rock. Huh? Oh, this is gonna be easy. <laughs> is this some kind of a joke? <gasps> that rock! It's floating! <laughs> no wonder! It's pumice stone! There is one final test, Astro Smurf. I'm ready! You must prove you can live harsh life of swoops. You must cook all meals, wash dishes, sweep, clean, and scrub. And you must kneel in respect before every swoof you meet. And kiss his beautiful feet. But, and all you can eat is wild grass. And you can never with sore thing. No matter how happy you are. And no holidays, including Smoof Moss and St. Swoofentine's Day. So, you must do all these things to be swoof. Well, on second thought, uh, maybe I'd better be smurfing back to Earth. Ah. What's going on? I feel so sleepy. Ah. Oh, I mustn't. Oh, uh. ah. 
He's asleep. The raspberry potion's working again. We'd better smurf to it. Oh, goody. There is nothing like a smurf. Nothing in the world. I hate this. Oh, how much farther, Pop Smurf? Oh, smurf up! Smurfette, the green clashes with my eyes. Mm, yum, yum, yum. If only I had a few more hands. Uh, Greedy, all you need's a few more muscles. Mm -hmm. See? Oh, gosh, this is really exciting, huh? <gasps> my wildest dream come true. A giant sing berry. I saw it first. It's mine. It's mine. Mine, mine, mine. Huh? Hey, help! Put me down! <laughs> Please, Smurfs, quiet! This frog is asking for our help! Huh? He says that beneath this pile of warts lies a prince! Oh! An evil wizard turned him into a frog, and he has been wandering the forest ever since, looking for a cure. Ah. To make matters worse, the spell becomes irreversible after three days. And today is the third day. Come, come, my friend. We must go to Toadstool Ravine and brew a rare wart moss poultice. Then you'll be a prince again. <laughs> Smurf good care of the village while we're gone. <laughs> bye! Bye-bye, Froggy. That Papa Smurf, he can solve any problem. Hey! Pass one back to the village is a rotten Smurf! Yeah! No! Oh, if only I was Papa Smurf, I'd set those Smurfs straight. I'd cure Hefty of his rudeness, clumsy of his clumsiness. I'd make every Smurf perfect, like me. That's it. That's exactly what I'll do. <laughs> While Papa Smurf's away, I'll just use his lab. When Papa Smurf comes back and sees what I've done, he'll make me a hero. Now, just two pinches of rare stinkweed powder and I'll be finished. Oh, Smurf! It's empty! Oh, well, I'll just use some of this instead. Oh, so noble a cause to die for lack of stinkweed. I'll bet Gargamel has plenty of stinkweed. But I can't borrow from him. Or can I? I oh, you're all 
always in the way. Oh, sorry, Bernie. Let me help you up. These Smurfs will never change. Unless I change them. Duty calls, and I, Brainy Smurf, must answer. Even if it means going to... Gargamel! Wouldn't you know Gargamel would have plenty of stinkweed? Hmm? Yeah, yeah, I'll get you in a smurf, I will. <laughs> I'll get all of you, I will, I will. <laughs> I will, I will. Thank <laughs> you. I smell smurfs. What's this? Dear Gargamel, I needed stinkweed powder to cure the smurfs of what ails them. I'm leaving Smurf Berries as payment. Sign, Brainy Smurf. Smurf Berries! Aha! The little thief left a trail. What luck! This should lead me straight to the Smurf Village. <laughs> 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 this is so easy, Azriel. I almost feel guilty. <laughs> it's just like <laughs> falling off a log. Oh, no! <coughs> yeah! Yeah! Those smurfs will pay for this and pay dearly. <laughs> You see, Azriel, the difference between Smurfs and us is we use our heads. Ouch! Watch your step. These Smurfs leave tricky trails. Yo! Oh, oh, oh. Ha! He thought he could escape through that sumac. <laughs> uh, sumac! But, but I'm allergic to sumac. <laughs> <laughs> the Smurf village can't be much farther, Azriel. It's it simply can't. <laughs> oh, we're, oh, oh, we're almost there, Azriel. I I can feel it. Oh, curses! He must have run out. I hate Smurfs! I hate them! I hate them! Wait. If he's lost all the stinkweed, he'll need more. <laughs> and that means the thieving little Smurf will be back again. <laughs> Come, Masriel. I have a plan. <laughs> Well, if it's a cure for Smurfs brain he wants, then that's what we'll give him. Yes, something to cure them of everything, including breathing. <laughs> We're mean, sour, crafty and cruel. We get our pleasure making a poll of Smurfs who live by the golden rule. We won't have a chance, Azriel. We'll do them in. The potion that sticks in their craw. I'm the slyest, horniest, downright orneriest wizard you ever saw. I mean, sour, crafty, and cruel. I'll make them sick in the wink of an eye. They'll sneeze and they'll cough and they'll really cry. <laughs> I 
I'll give up some tummies to those blue little dummies. <laughs> I'll do them in with a potion that sticks in their craw. I'm the slyest, thorniest, downright orneriest wizard you ever saw. I mean, sour, crafty, and cruel. I'll make them sick in the wink of an eye. I'll sneeze and they'll cough and they'll really cry. <laughs> for all your problems. See? Papa Smurf will be proud of what I'm about to do for all Smurf kind. Uh, but Brainy, there's nothing in there. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead and laugh. I'll prove what a great Smurf I am. You just wait and see. Here he comes, Azriel. Here he comes. Just as I knew he would. <laughs> Time for Betty Pie. for all illnesses. Why, this is worth a ton of nasty old stinkweed. But it smells even worse. <laughs> all right, who's going to be the first? Just one spoonful of Brainy's cure-all and you'll feel like a new Smurf. But gosh, Brainy, I never felt better in my life. And I never smelled anything worse in my life. Yeah. Woo, you can keep it, Brainy. We don't want any. Yeah, I don't want to smell. Oh. Hmm. Ah, uh, gee, Greedy, you look awfully hungry. Yeah. Well, why don't you ring the lunch bell and I'll stir the soup for you? Gee, thanks, Brainy. Someday they'll thank me for this. Soup's on! Come and smurf it! <laughs> hey, save some for me! They're gonna thank me for this. Oh, all of a sudden, I don't feel so good. Yeah, neither do I. Heavens, the smurf with droids. What have I done? I guess Smurfs of a feather flock together. Oh, if only Papa Smurf was here. But if he was, he'd never forgive me. Oh, Smurf is me. There's no one to turn to except Gargamel. What is it? <clears throat> a Smurf. Keep out. Go away. You're sickly. I'm not sickly. I'm brainy. And I need your help. My help? He's delirious, Azriel. The disease has affected his mind. Oh, I know I shouldn't have taken your cure-all, but I was desperate. Now all the Smurfs are sick. Only sick? Curses. My potion must not have been strong enough. No. Oh, you poor little Smurf. Come in, come in, and I'll see what I can do for you. I might have a potion which could cure your Smurf. Oh, that's wonderful. That's... Uh, but, on one condition, it will only work if I go to the Smurf village and administer it personally. You come to the village? 
Oh, I, I, I could never allow that. Well, then, goodbye and good luck. And try to make your Smurfs' last few hours comfortable. Wait, wait! If I took you to the village, would you promise not to do anything bad? I may do some despicable, rotten things from time to time. But even I would never kick a Smurf when he's down. And to prove it, I'll go blindfolded. That way, the location of your village will remain a secret. Well... Okay. Oh, I hope none of my fellow wizards see me like this. But in the end, I'll get everything I so richly deserve. <laughs> Ouch! Ooh! Ouch! Oh, is it much farther? Not far now. Yow! Yow! Azriel, get off me this instant! Much farther now? Uh, no, we'll take a shortcut through this sumac. Sumac? But, but, but I'm allergic to sumac. No, no, no. Is it much farther now? No, just across this pond. Pond? No! <laughs> <laughs> Here we are. Oh, oh, thank heaven for small favors. See? They all think they're birds. No, not birds. Uh, more like sitting ducks. Gargamel, <laughs> 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 you promised to behave. I had my fingers crossed. I had my... <laughs> You little acorn brain! Help! Help! Papa Smurf! Help! Papa Smurf! <laughs> come to Gargamel, my little bird brain. Come, come to dear old Gargamel. <laughs> Tried this formula in over a hundred years, so keep your fingers crossed. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, sorry. <laughs> Smurf a Cadabra, Smurf a Kazan. Change this poor frog to a prince again. Uh, again. <laughs> Like I always say, if at first you don't succeed, smurf, smurf again. Fawn <sighs> magical powers and trust your fate, and soon you'll return to your natural state. <laughs> like I always say, if at first you don't succeed, smurf, smurf again, and again, and again. Brainy, this is the prince who used to be a frog. And if there's ever any way I can repay you, Smurfs. Oh, there is, there is. Get Gargamel out of our village. Gargamel? I'll handle the knave. Which way to your village? Straight ahead, prince. <laughs> 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 There's no escaping me now, you rotten little bird brains. What the? Unhand those Smurfs. Never. Run, Nasriel. <laughs> No, no, stay away from me! 
Get ready, Brainy. Here he comes. My Smurfs! I lost my Smurfs! <laughs> Open Brainy, in his condition, Azrael won't bite. Oh, but, but Willie Peck. I must find those Smurfs. I won't leave empty-handed. There they are. <laughs> okay, I'm going, I'm going. And never show your face here again. At least I got some of you rotten smurfs, and in a moment your health worries will be over. For good! Aziel, uh. get away from me! You're sick, sick, sick! Why me? Why me? Hang on, my little Smurfs. The remedy is nearly finished. I'm, I'm sorry I caused so much trouble, Papa Smurf, but I wanted to be a great problem solver like you. Greeny, you can't become a great anything overnight. It takes time and hard work to Smurf how to do things right. Here, this should have you all bursting with help in no time. Hey, I'm blue again. I feel smurfy. Hooray, Hooray for Papa Smurf! Hooray! 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 In this time of celebration, let us remember those less fortunate than ourselves with this Get Well poem. <coughs> to Gargamel and Azrael. Sorry you aren't feeling well. Accept this Get Well wish we send and enjoy the taste of your own medicine. La, 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 la. Mummy was thinking of. Well, there'll be no party here. Never has been, never will be. Ah! Halloween! Bah! 
birthdays. Bah! And you think those rotten Smurfs would be having a party? Ouch! Stupid fly. To think those little blue beasts would be celebrating and giving thanks for a good harvest. It's enough to make me throw up. I'll harvest them. I'll harvest their little blue heads right off. Stop all that happiness out there! Do you hear? Stop it! Oh, well. Perhaps Mummy will send some hard raisins. She did last year. And one for Queenie, and one for Vanity, and one for Happy, and one for Smurf, and one for... <laughs> one for Ryan! <laughs> oh, I just love Halloween. Don't you, Harold? I'm so looking forward to frightening the little children. <laughs> Maybe they'll cry. Oh, they get such a good scare. <laughs> Sometimes it takes years for the little dears to get over it. <laughs> Some of them never get over it. Yes, my pet, soon, soon we shall fly across the hallowed moon and swoop down on the sleeping villagers. Let them hand out their garlic. Let them say their prayers. Let them do what they like. But there is no warding off Hogatha the witch. <laughs> Lazy Smurf, take Jokey's cart out into the forest and see if you can find some red leaves for decorations. Yes, Papa Smurf. Hurry, soon it will be time for Jokey's birthday party. Yes, Papa Smurf. <laughs> As I have been saying, Papa Smurf, Lazy's lack of a sense of social responsibility is appalling. I was telling Smurfette just the other day that Papa Smurf... Goodbye, safe journey! Oh, I do hate to see them go. Oh, well, they'll be back. Uh, now, now, where was I? Oh, yes, the leaves. Oh, they're so lovely. My darlings, you look so lovely just the way you are, but time marches on, you know. Sleep, my little ones. Sleep until next year. Oh, these miserable corns. Now what? Some imbecile child looking for a Halloween treat? I'll give them a treat. I'll give them a good rap on the knuckles with my stick. Well, what have we here? Someone remembered my birthday after all. Well, let's see now. Uh, who could it be from? Uh, Mummy? Godfather? Uh, perhaps? Ah, I wonder... Happy birthday, Gargamel! <laughs> Happy birthday! <laughs> Humiliate me, will they? I'll give you a Halloween! I'll give you a present! <laughs> There isn't a red leaf in sight. All this work has made me sleepy. Oh, maybe a little nap. Maybe when I wake up, the leaves will be red. Well, I don't... You worthless cat, letting him get away. You'll go without for that failure. Ah, here we are. I'll show those rotten smurfs. Mock my birthday, will they? I'll show them. They'll never forget this Halloween. They'll never forget it. Sleep well. Oh, I love this spot. Look at me! Look at me! Oh, 
I'm so sorry, really. Do something. Can't you do something? Well, I... Uh, well, I'd like to. But you see, Autumn cannot wait, you know. Oh, change me back to blue. Well, I can't make you blue with a red wand. Oh, my. I don't even own a blue wand. What color have you got? Well, there's uh, red, obviously, and white, and yellow, and green. How about green? Blue. Oh, you poor dear. You've got to do something right now. Well, I can't do anything now. I have work to do. Autumn cannot wait. Father Time likes things just so. You can't undo me? A red wand is a red wand, you know. Uh, perhaps when I'm finished. Uh, uh, perhaps this winter. Uh, uh, maybe next spring at the latest. You just run along home and wait for me. I shan't be too long, but uh, first things first, you know. This is horrible. Look at me. I can't go home again. Who is that? 
It's me. Who? Hagatha. Carcamel. What are you doing up there, you ugly old crone? Crone? <laughs> nice weather we're having. A fine example of my superior magic, don't you think? Oh, you did this. You're the reason I'm missing Halloween. You spoiled our Hallow's Eve. Why? Why? Just to spite those stupid Smurfs? Don't you realize I spent an entire year getting ready for this one night? Don't you realize if I don't make my rounds, the little children might even be disappointed that they like being frightened? So you see, Father Time, the poor little creature is all red. I just don't know what to do. He's so ashamed. He'll probably miss Jokey's birthday party. You are well aware time cannot be turned back. The idea is unthinkable. My own fault, really. I should have looked before I zapped. Oh, there must be something we can do. Nothing. Now, Father, the least you can do is try. To go back in time? Mother, this is a serious matter. More than serious, it just isn't done. Perhaps you could go back and get my other wands. Mother, I have more important things to do than fetch wands. There's a jar of snuff berry jam in the cupboard. Uh, there is? Get him, Asriel, get him! Gotcha! <laughs> Well, 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 what have we here? A red smurf? A red smurf? <laughs> well, what have you got to say for yourself, eh? I wonder how it happened. I wonder if this condition changes the chemical composition. He's mine, anyway. Do you suppose one red smurf is the equivalent of six blue ones? I saw him first. No, 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 he's mine. Mine? Mine! Hefty, you take a group to Gargamel's and see if he's there. Yes, Papa Smurf. Smurfette, organize a group and come with me. We'll search the forest. Yes, Papa Smurf. And the rest of you. Yes, yes Papa, Papa Smurf. Smurf. Put away those umbrellas. Yes, Papa Smurf. My dear Hagatha, why don't we work this out like reasonable people? If you don't give him to me, I'll turn you into a toad. We could share. What's share? We could each make use of him. Oh, let's cut him in half. Good, uh, I think. Uh, where will we do it? Your place or mine? Well, obviously your bird is in no condition to fly and it's too far to walk. Besides, my corns are acting up. I don't trust you. Just give him to me. I found him. I have him. I'll turn you into a toad. You don't have your wand. Lazy. Lazy. Lazy! He's not here! <laughs> ah, Mother, you do make fine jam! There, it's done! <laughs> How beautiful! Now I must hurry and tell dear Papa Smurf about poor little Lazy. Oh, I do wish Father Time would reconsider. Oh, hurry up! I can't stand it! Hefty, what'll we do? I don't know! I hate I don't know! Agatha, the witch of all Hallow's Eve? And Lazy Smurf is red? Amazing! Hurry, my Smurfs! Time is short! Lazy is in great danger! Oh, Papa Smurf! Here's the wagon! I can't believe it! Can you believe he's asleep? What's going on? They're going to saw Lazy in half. Oh, no, they're not! This idea is ridiculous. What's ridiculous about it? Well, I've been thinking. A, a red smurf is such a rarity. I, I can think of so many possibilities. 
dried, for instance, he might make a wonderful chili powder. And how do we know that he's a Smurf at all? I've never seen a red Smurf. Oh, get on with it! Oh, Papa Smurf, we must do something. FD the blanket. I tell you, Hugger, that this is a mistake. If nothing else, we can hold him for ransom. It is only a matter of time before the Blue Smurfs show up. Get on with it! <gasps> Listen to me, you old crone! This Smurf, whatever his color, is worth more as one than he is as two! I refuse to carry out your imbecilic idea! <coughs> Look! A Smurf! Oh, another! Now! <coughs> gotcha! <coughs> what the... <coughs> Oh, they're getting <laughs> away! <laughs> hurry, hurry! <laughs> oh, you fool! This is all your fault! <laughs> Stop it! Stop it, you old crone! <laughs> Destroy my Halloween, will you? <laughs> so bad? Red, green, purple, who cares? It's being a Smurf that counts. As I said to Papa Smurf... Brady, please. Mother Nature meant no harm, Lazy. She ruined my Halloween. No, she didn't. Look at it this way. Now you don't need a costume. <laughs> Brainy. Maybe being red has some compensations you haven't even considered yet, like... Brainy! But you must help him. Mother, there's nothing I can do. But one little smurf. Surely you can do something. Really, Father, you make the simplest thing sound so... It's, uh, uh, are you sure you had enough to eat? There's a lot more jam. More jam? Yes, more jam. Mother, you are very persuasive. Um, just this once, I'll do it. Oh, Father, you are a wonder! <clears throat> Red wand, white wand, green and yellow. Change not the world, just one little fellow. Look at it this way. Maybe it's a blessing in disguise. I mean... Oh. Papa Smurf! What's going on here? Oh, I don't know, Papa Smurf. He was just sitting there when suddenly... I hate Sunbury! Oh! I'm me again! I'm blue! Yay! Thank you, Mother Nature, wherever you are, and happy Halloween! <laughs> just in time for the party. Ooh, you're just in time for a nap, if you ask me. We wish you a happy birthday, we wish you a happy birthday, we wish you a happy birthday and Halloween too. I sure could use a nap. Oh. Hey, farmer! See if you can get any work out of that smurf for nothing lazy smurf! Hello, farmer. You start gathering nuts, lazy. Meanwhile, I'll be tending my fields. Work, work, work. Will it ever end? I said I want that now. That lazy, always lying down on the job. Lazy Smurf, come back with my wash. Getting 
so a Smurf can't get any sleep around here. A pinch of this and a dash of that. Hey, Brainy, I have to step out for a minute, and I'm trusting you to make sure my potion doesn't burn. Oh, you can count on me, Papa Smurf. No job is too difficult for Brainy Smurf. No task is too Just hazardous to watch the smurf, potion, but... Brainy. Potion watching requires great concentration. So here goes. <laughs> mm, yeah, how can I concentrate with that going on? <laughs> Lazy Smurf. <laughs> What's that? Who called? Always dozing off. You'll never get ahead that way. I, for instance, am watching Papa Smurf's potion to make sure it doesn't... Burn! Oh, no! Thank goodness Papa didn't see this. Uh-oh. Oh, um, uh, uh, sorry, Papa Smurf, it wasn't my fault. See, Lady was sorry. Never mind the excuses. You just burned up the last of my Elmwood leaves. Now I'll have to get more. And I'll help. No, thanks, Brainy. You've helped enough for one day. My little Smurfs, I'm off to Smurf Swamp to gather Elmwood leaves. Stay out of trouble while I'm gone. We will, Papa Smurf. I know just how to stay out of trouble. Ooh, I'll have a nice long nap. How do you like that lazy Smurf? While we work, he sleeps. Yeah, and causes trouble. I hate trouble. Say, how'd you like to Smurf Lazy a lesson he'll never forget? I'm listening. Yeah, I right. hate listening. Yeah, right. Okay, first thing we do is... Wow, what a nap. Bet it's almost time for supper. Huh? What a mess. And where is every Smurf? Smurfette! Smurfette! What's going on around? Oh, Smurfette! What, what's happened to you? Who are you? Uh, I'm Lazy. Lazy Smurf. No, no, impossible. Why, Lazy Smurf disappeared over 300 years ago. 300 years? Boy, that was some nap. Who's the youngster, Smurfette? Why, it's Lazy Smurf. And where might you have been all these years, Lazy? Oh, uh, asleep, I guess. Here, Lazy. Welcome back, surprise. <laughs> Oh, I guess we're just too old to work. <laughs> yeah, too old like us. That's why we're glad you're here, Lazy. Yes, now you can do the chores we can't do anymore. Like chop wood. And work the fields. And make lots of goodies. Well, I can't do all that with Papa Smurf. But Papa Smurf! Uh, didn't we tell you? Papa Smurf is gone. <laughs> Smurfs. I'll help you all I can. Oh, thanks, Lazy. Yeah, thanks. Uh, you're welcome. I think. Ah, uh, this is the life. Uh, handy. I'll say. Oh, Lazy, uh, could you bring me another drink? Uh, yes, I'm uh, coming, Hefty. As long as you're up, Lazy, could you turn my page? They're all so heavy. And bring me another slice of pie. I have a backache, you know. And clean my mirror. And sweep my floor. And sharpen my hole. And bring me another book. And fix this wheel. Uh, if I'd known I'd be smurfing this hard, I'd have slept another hundred years. I can't do this another day. If only Papa Smurf were still around, he'd have a spell to fix everything. Of course! That's it! Let's see. Uh, you spell. Uh, young, younger, youngest. Perfect. If I can just stay awake long enough, I'm so tired. Uh, no. Now, if I don't get these Smurfs back to normal, I'll never get any rest. Ooh. Uh, now for the last ingredient. I sure hope it works. I'm so tired. It worked! It worked! And just in time! I'm hungry! Yeah. Where is our breakfast? Crazy! Here you are, Smurf. Dig in. I do 
don't know what they are, but anything blue can't be all bad. <laughs> Any second now, they'll change back to their normal young selves. Mm. Yeah, weird, but good. You're not smurfing. Yeah, weird, but good for the mind. I hate weird. Eat it all or no dessert. Any second now. <laughs> Almost any second. Good chow, Lizzie. Yes, real good. But not as good as the old days. You don't mind if we rest our old bones while you clean up, do you? Uh, no, of course not. Oh, I give up. Maybe I'll wake up and it'll all be a bad dream. <laughs> Done. So that's it. It was all a trick. They weren't really old. But now they're really young. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> that was Smurfy. Let's Smurf it again. Hold it. This is no time to play. We have big problems. Uh, you old body Smurfer. We'll find someone else to play with. Wait, stop! Come back! This time I will not fail, Azriel. I am creating a spell to bring those vile little Smurfs right to my doorstep. This is very delicate work. I must have absolute silence. It's ruined! You, whoever you are out there, you'll pay for this! Hi, mister. <gasps> Wanna play with us? Play? Oh, 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 why, of course! Come right in! <laughs> oh, oh, this is awful! But wait, if they weren't really old to begin with, then Papa Smurf's still alive! Hello, my little Smurfs, I'm back. Little Smurfs? What's this? Hmm, something strange is going on. Great Smurfs, something very strange is going on. Some Smurf has made a youth potion. Oh, this could be very dangerous. I'd better prepare an antidote and go find him. Papa Smurf! Papa Smurf! Can you find him anywhere? Yikes! Lazy Smurf, what's going on? Oh, Papa Smurf, the most terrible thing has happened. All the Smurfs are in Gargamels. Gargamels? I was afraid of this. Hurry, Feathers, as fast as you can. <laughs> Yoo-hoo, mister, we want to play something else now. Yeah, it's getting warm in here. That's because it's almost time for dinner. My dinner. <laughs> Rockabye, little Smurfs, in my favorite stew pot. Soon you'll all be blue fondue, and then I'll serve you all up a hot. We're too late, Papa Smurf. Not yet. If I can get inside with this aging potion, we can still save them. But I'll need your help. My help? Uh -huh. By doing what you do best. <laughs> Quiet! Smurfs should be steamed, not heard. <laughs> What's that? Another Smurf! And bigger than the rest! Oh, this must be my lucky day! You're just in time to join us for dinner, Smurf. <laughs> Watch closely now. The secret is in the seasoning. Wait! What is this stuff? Yeah! Oh, oh, what's happening to me? Look at me, Azriel. I, I've grown old before my time. Yeah. Oh, I hate Smurfs. Oh, how I hate them. And I hope this has been a lesson to you all. We're sorry, Papa Smurf. No more tricks for us. And no more being lazy for me. 
After all, if we're gonna smurf a better world, we all have to smurf together, right? Right! <laughs> I don't like the look of this, Vanity. The river's rising much too fast. I've never seen the river this ugly. I can barely see myself in it. Hmm. Spring is very early this year. The dam can't hold the early runoff. What, what was that, Papa Smurf? That's just what I was afraid of. Run and find handy and hurry. The dam must be strengthened at once. Yes, Papa Smurf. I hope the news from Mount Smurf is good. Otherwise, the entire Smurf village may be underwater. Oh, this is awful. Why did Papa Smurf send me up here? My cold is worse. I should be home in my nice warm bed. What about me? What if something important happens while I'm gone? Papa Smurf may need my expert help. Will you two stop complaining? Papa Smurf sent us to check on how deep the snow is. And that's just what we're gonna do. <laughs> yes, Smurf said. You mean we have to go up there? Yes. Here, Brainy, you can check the snow depth when we reach the top. Well, this should be the place. <laughs> if we can find the marker rock, we'll know we're in the right place to measure the depth of the snow. Brainy! Yes? That's it! That's marker rock! Why is it so tiny this year? It's usually six months tall. Go ahead, Brainy. See if the snow is deeper than the red mark on the marking stick. Very well. I can assure you the snow is exactly as deep as it's supposed to be for this time of year. Oh! Oh, Brainy, are you all right? Help! Get me out of here! Sickly Smurf, I need your help. Brainy, stop! Thank you, but actually, I never really needed any assistance. Achoo! Brady, are you all right? Well, actually, perhaps I could use a little assistance. This is awful. You're telling me. I forgot my hot water bottle. No, I mean there's too much snow for this time of year. If it all melts under this hot sun, the river will overflow, the dam will break, and the village will be destroyed. Achoo! The first thing we must do in a situation like this is to remain calm. It is only by remaining calm that... Hey, wait for me! I call it a greenhouse. It'll grow food even when the weather's cold outside. Weather's fine, Handy. Handy, Handy, Papa Smurf needs you with a dam right away. He said it was an emergency. Coming, Papa Smurf, coming! I, Brainy Smurf, a most accomplished skier, passed Sickly Smurf as if he were standing still. <laughs> We'll wait for Sickly right here. I, for one, am sorry to see spring come so early this year. I hardly had time to show off my unsurpassed skills as a mountaineer. What's happening? Whoa! Uh, applying the laws of physics and gravity, we should come to the bottom of the hill soon. Oh, the first flowers of spring. Oh, I've never seen flowers like these before. Or have I? We don't have time to pick flowers, Smurfette. Papa Smurf is fragrant. Papa Smurf? <laughs> Who is this Papa Smurf? Papa Smurf? I don't know. <laughs> Come on, you two. Papa Smurf is waiting. There's that name again. Let's go. I, I wonder, wonder who that is. is. I, I wonder, wonder who you are. are. I, I wonder, wonder who, who I am. am. Hurry, my little Smurfs! The water's rising fast! That's the last one, Papa Smurf! Very good. Handy, open the sluice gate. Yay! Even with the gate open, the dam can't take much more weight. I don't understand it. Without the snow report, I can't decide if the village needs to be evacuated. They should be back by now. <laughs> my cold is getting worse. Hey, this way. The village is this way. Do you know what he's talking about? No, but whatever it is, it seems to be important. I wonder who he is. Come on. 
Are you sure you would like some of these beautiful flowers? No flowers. I'm allergic to flowers. La 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 chu. La 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 la. La 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 chu. La 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 la. That's real cool. I'm allergic to cats too, especially this one. Kitty, 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 kitty. Oh, that's a good kitty. I think he likes us. Here, kitty. Smell the pretty flowers. I think they're scrumptious. Faster, faster. If the water rises so much higher, the dam won't hold. We're back. There you are. What about the snowpack? Well, <laughs> snowpack? I forget. What's the snowpack? That snowpack, the one you were supposed to check. Well, the snowpack is... <laughs> <laughs> oh, have a flower. They're the first flowers of spring. But Papa Smurf needs to know... Thanks. Needs to know... Who needs to know? And what does he need to know? <laughs> the snowpack. Papa Smurf needs to know about the... <laughs> <laughs> And one for you, and one for you, and one for you. What a smurfy thing. I wonder what it's for. I know. Boy, I sure am hungry. I wonder what I like to eat. Me too. Let's see what's in this box. <laughs> Was it good? I think so. Who are all these little blue creatures? Oh, I don't know who you are, but you sure are a handsome devil. Papa Smurf! Papa Smurf! Achoo! I wonder what's wrong with that little fellow with the cold. Who cares? Let's sing. La, 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 la. Just as I feared. At this rate, the dam will collapse in exactly one hour. I must evacuate the village at once. Boom! Sickly! The snowpack! How deep was it? <laughs> Papa Smurf, there's something wrong with the hatch, with the hatch, the other Smurfs. Amazing! Why have you Smurfs stopped work on the dam? Oh, what dam? What dam? What Smurfs? Oh, Papa Smurf, I was trying to hatch. Smurfette. Maybe you can tell me what's going on. I don't know. I forget. Would you like a flower? Papa Smurf, no, don't smell it. <laughs> Achoo! Achoo! Hmm. Now, what did Mother Nature say about this flower? <laughs> Papa Smurf, don't... Achoo! What was it? Who was it? Who am I? It's Papa Smurf, the snow pack. It's <laughs> too deep. The villages and the danger. What snowpack? What village? What what danger? Papa Smurf said Mother Danger warned when warned him about those flowers. I've got to find their help, Mother Nature. Oh, my! That sounds like one of the little Smurfs. Mother! <laughs> Nature! Oh, dear! What is it, little one? Oh, oh Mother Nature! Oh, you've got to help them! <laughs> there, there, there! Tell Mother Nature all about it! Well, it all started with Papa Smurf sending the Mount Smurf to check the snowpack because the river was rising too fast and the dam was about to break. And then Smurfette and Brady found these yellow flowers that made them forget. Yellow flowers? Forget? Oh, dear me. I forgot all about those terrible little forget-me flowers. Well, they've caused me trouble for the last time. A sudden cold spell will cure our woes. Freeze the river and chill our toes. Thank, 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 thank you, Mother Nature. Oh, I better hurry back to the village. I told Father Time that spring was coming too early this year. Maybe next time he listened to me. What's going on? I hate snow! Brady, how did we get here? I don't know, Smurfette, but let me take a calculated guess. Now, as I recall... Forget it, Brady. 
Where am I? Oh, there I am. Oh, the first flowers of spring. And now they're gone? I have a feeling Mother Nature thinks it's for a better Smurfette. Now, I better check the dam. Maybe this cold weather will freeze the water and save the village. The water has stopped rising. The village is saved. But, but, ah, I think I'm catching cold. Ah, uh, thank you, Sickly. Here, 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 ah, Here's the Smurf noodle soup. Yeah. Time for you to get in bed too, Greedy. Mustn't let your cold get any worse. Take it from a Smurf that knows. Oh, Sickly, could you bring me some Smurf noodle soup, please? <sighs> me too. Well, I'll sure be glad when everyone else is well. Then it'll be my turn to be sick again. All right, Smurfs, make sure you pick just the right ones. Well, there's only one way to be really sure, Hefty. That's good, but not perfect. A few more weeks, maybe. Ready? More picking and less tasting. See? Clumsy and grouchy have the right idea. I hate going up and going down. Whoa! No, at this rate, we'll never get out of here. How oh, right he is, eh, Azriel? <laughs> now we're smurfing. This is our last bush. Hey, we missed these two. Better see if they're right. <laughs> Yo! I hate Gargamel. Azriel, get him! Oh, rotten, miserable cat. <laughs> oh, boy, is Azriel going to be surprised? <laughs> Azriel, I'll turn you into fur-lined earmuffs. Uh, keep going! They're still after us! Faster, Azriel! Faster! I think they're starting to tire! They're starting to tire? <laughs> I've... I've had it. <laughs> if I were ten years younger, I could catch those little blue wretches. <laughs> Oh. Smurfs! What happened? Oh, oh, Gargamel and Azrael chased us, Papa Smurf, but we escaped. Lucky for them, too. I would have flattened them. But unlucky for us, we lost all our Smurf berries. Serves you right. Carelessness causes accidents. To the victor belongs the Smurf berries and... I was only trying to cheer you up. I have just the thing to cheer you all up. Ooh! Mmm, ah. Smurf berries. Oh, but Papa Smurf, that's your own private supply. <laughs> Sharing them is more fun. Besides, I uh, don't really need them. Thank you! Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Enjoy yourselves. I have errands to run. Bye-bye, Papa Smurf! Mmm, that Papa Smurf sure is nice. Mm, yes, he does so much for us. I wish we could Smurf something nice for him. Yeah, I wonder what he'd like. I know. I've seen a list of his favorite things. Oh, yeah? Where? In one of Papa Smurf's books. Come on, I'll show you. I hate lists, but I love Papa Smurf. This is it. No, no, wait. Uh, it's this one. No, maybe it's that one. Oh, I knew this was a waste of time. Uh, yeah, a waste of time. I'm not so smurfly positive this is it. My favorite thing. It's Papa Smurf's handwriting, all right. Good work, clumsy. You found the list. Well, I was just getting 
to it. Let's see. Simple song, poetry. Pretty pictures, fragrant flowers, and fresh pork salad with tame mushrooms. Ooh, I'll pick some flowers. And I'll make a salad. We'll help, Greedy. And I'll supervise, because Papa Smurf always says, a troop without a leader is like a ship without a rudder, and leaders are... Hey, wait for me! Well, we have everything but cave mushrooms, and we've smurfed every cave. There must be another cave around here. No, no. Papa Smurf always says that fools rush in where Smurfs fear to tread, and you can fool some of the Smurfs some of the time, but not all of the... No cave around here, huh, Branny? Well, I... I guess Papa Smurf was... Wow, look at all these mushrooms. And look over here. Ooh, what a smurfy palm. And such pretty flowers. Uh, did you see that? He drank that water and made him young again. Oh, what a wonderful present for Papa Smurf. The gift of youth. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. oh, this should be enough. Hey! <laughs> this is my pond, and you are trespassers. It's a troll. <laughs> You're a nasty old meanie. We only wanted some water. <sighs> no one takes water from my pond without leaving a nice present. Well, th that's perfectly understandable. So we'll just be moving along and... Uh... This is a good present. No, that's Papa Smurf's. It is mine now. <laughs> <laughs> Give it back, you, you big... Now, take your water. Uh, right, the water. But not too much. Uh, hurry it up, Hefty. Hefty, wait! What do you want? I wanted to give you a, a, a surprise. <laughs> ah! Smurfs for this. Uh-oh. Careful. We don't want to wake Papa Smurf. That's right. Shh. Pass it on. Shh. 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 Uh. <laughs> what are you trying to do? Wake up, Papa Smurf. Now get this stuff put away. Here, let me Smurf you a hand, Hefty. Oh, thanks, Papa Smurf. Papa Smurf! Isn't it late to be working so hard, my little Smurf? Uh, we'll take those, Papa Smurf. No, no, no. Every Smurf must pull his own weight. <sighs> By the way, what's in these sacks? <laughs> it's a surprise! Uh, uh, he means supplies, Papa Smurf. Phew. I am a bit thirsty. Uh, here, Papa Smurf. <laughs> Uh, never mind this old stuff, Papa Smurf. We'll get you some fresh water. No, no, this is fine. <sighs> well, I'm going back to bed. I'm not as young as I used to be. You soon will be. Oh, goodness, the water didn't work. That troll cheated us. And now he has Papa Smurf's book, too. Boy, is Papa Smurf going to be mad when he finds out? Well, let's give him all his surprises. Then he can't be mad. <laughs> no, I wouldn't bet on that. Everybody ready? Yeah, all right. Here he comes. One, two, three. Surprise, Papa Smurf. Papa Smurf? Smurf. 
but he drank too much. Oh, dear. What have we done? Ooh, we're in big trouble without Papa Smurf to lead us. Because young Smurf shouldn't. Okay, okay. Let Smurf hide and seek instead. You're it. Now, close your eyes and count to a thousand. A thousand? Why? Can't you count to a thousand? Um, uh, of course. No, you can't. Yes, I can. Can't. Can. Can't. I'll show you, you young whipper Smurfer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> now to find the other Smurfs. 58, 59, 60. Uh, Brainy, a uh, little Papa Smurf's running off into... No fair helping me, clumsy. 61, 62. But, but, uh, Brainy, uh, what if Papa Smurf gets lost? He's supposed to get lost, and I'm supposed to find him. We're playing hide and seek, and now you've made me lose my count. Oh, gee, sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There he is. He's asleep. Now's that chance. Ah, he doesn't scare me. <coughs> around here somewhere. Is this what you're looking for? <laughs> that book belongs to me now, and soon you will belong to me. Oh, oh no, no, we won't! Uh, you can't escape. Oh, my, right! Oh, please let us go, Mr. Troll. <laughs> no one leaves unless I get a gift. But we didn't bring anything. I did. Yeah, you 
Briny surf away from forest and stinking smurf. I hope I catch a big fat fish, for it will make a tasty dish. <laughs> Hi, kitty cat! Hmm. <laughs> Any smurfs pass by here? Hmm. Maybe I won't go hungry after all. Uh, uh, smurfs, did you say? Yeah, smurfs. Hey, are you a troll? A troll? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm a nice, friendly wizard. Really? Boy, you're sure ugly enough to be a troll. Why, you... Azriel, get him! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, the kitty wanna play? Catch me! Don't let him escape! Go! Hey! You're not a nice wizard! Stop, you miserable smurf! I gotcha! Come back here, you ooh. <laughs> Don't let him get away! Stop him, there he goes! Oh, I hope I never see another Smurf again. Yeah. Oh, Gargamel! Oh, more Smurfs! Go away! I'm getting too old to chase you vile little pests anymore. But, Gargamel, we found just what you need. And what might that be? We know where there's a pond of water that makes you young. Young? You, you found the fountain of youth? Yes, and we'll show you where it is. If you promise to get our book back from the troll who lives there. Hmm, but how do I know that there's a fountain of youth? Where's your proof? Uh, proof? Well, uh... Bye, guys. Long time no smurf. Hey, that's the mean old wizard who chased me. Let's get him. Easy, Papa Smurf. We need his help. Papa <laughs> Smurf? This is Papa Smurf? Then your story is true. Hey, what do you think you're looking at? Put me down. Next time, smurf on someone your own side. Uh, all right, I'll get your precious book back. Uh, just lead me to that fountain of youth. A pond's right through there. And so's the troll. Well, he's no match for my wizardry. Wait here. I'll get your book back. But he didn't even ask where the book was hidden. You can't trust him. Any Smurf can see that. You're right, Papa Smurf. But he might help us in spite of himself. Come on. No sign of the vile troll. This is going to be easy. <laughs> no one takes my water without giving me a gift. <laughs> oh, a gift? Oh, yeah, of course, of course. Uh, uh, I have one uh, someplace uh, in here. Ah, here it is. <laughs> Soon, vile troll, you will be a harmless toad. <laughs> Something went wrong. I'll turn you into a gentle butterfly. Boy, what a dumb wizard he is. That's why we asked for his help. Come on, let's get the book. Okay, you asked for it. There! That showed him! 
Miserable little vile blue boobs, Azriel. <laughs> Come, Azriel, let's check the other traps. Oh, that's a high one. Oh, thanks, Gargamel. Gargamel! An ode to a Smurf fairy. <clears throat> oh, berries so red, berries so sweet. Sometimes berries. Gargamel! Oh, to getting out of here. Come on, Scanny! Jokey, Vanity, run for your Smurfs. It's Gargamel! Run, run! Don't worry, Azriel. I have traps everywhere. They can't escape me. <laughs> no! Azriel, don't just sit there, you idiot. Get me down. Gargamel stepped into one of his own traps. He really stuck his foot in it this time. <laughs> Come on, let's get back to the village and tell Papa Smurf. Oh, this is mortifying, mortifying. How will I ever get down? Ooh, those miserable Smurfs. They'll pay for this! Yeah! No, I can't stand it, Hazriel! I can't, I can't, I can't! Oh, I hate those Smurfs! I hate Smurfs! Oh, how I hate them! This calls for drastic and desperate measures, Azriel. I must seek the advice of Madame Trilby. Yes, but, but, but how? How? She'll never help me. Well, she detests me. She hates me. She loathes me. Think, Gargamel. Think, think, think. I've got it. Oh, I'm brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. <laughs> I know it's in here somewhere. Ah, here it is. My genuine cut glass imitation ruby. I'll buy Madame Trilby's services with this fake ruby. She'll never know the difference. <laughs> F 
faster, Asriel, faster! We're still a long, long way from Madame Trilby's. Onward, onward! <coughs> there it is, Asriel. Madame Trilby's. Keep your fingers crossed. Gargamel, you wretched wizard. What are you doing here? You know I loathe and despise everything you stand for. Uh, but, Madame Trilby, I need... Uh, Madame Trilby, I have come to ask you... The very sight of you makes me ill. Now, go away! This will make her change her mind. <laughs> Now that I have your attention, uh, perhaps... Uh, I... oh, 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 the pain! Oh, the humiliation! Oh, Madam Trilby, I have a proposition you may find very interesting. I'm listening. Uh, if you help me catch those miserable Smurfs, the ruby is yours! Smurfs? Hmm. Very well, Gargamel. I'll help you. This magic flute will bring you the Smurfs. That's amazing. Absorb. <laughs> you see, when you play these magic flutes tonight, the Smurfs will sleep walk out of their village, into the forest, and into your grimy little hands. Ah, tonight the Smurfs will pay the piper! <laughs> my, oh my, all that harvesting certainly is hard on my peaches and Smurf berry complexion. I'm so tired, I could sleep for a week. Well, I always say brains over brawn is the... Never mind, I'm too tired. I'm even too tired to eat. Good night, Sloppy. Nighty night, Vanity. Good night, Brainy. Night, Smurfette. Good night, Papa Smurf. This flute better live up to expectations, Azriel, or Madame Trilby will pay dearly. Ah, look! Smurf berries. That means Smurfs can't be too far away. Well, we shall see. we can find their rotten village. What in Smurf? <gasps> Clumsy? Oh, Papa Smurf! What are you doing out here in the Smurf of the night? Uh, I don't know. What are you doing out here? What happened here? The village, my lab! Oh, my beautiful flowers! They're all ruined! Who could have done such a terrible thing? Yay! My beautiful pants! Oh, they're all ruined! Ruined! Oh, no! How can this be? Who is responsible for this savage attack upon my art? Hager? What did you do to my foot? And my head! Me? What did you do to my master Pesa? I didn't do anything to your master Pesa! I just woke up and found my foot yellow! And my head red! Wait! Wait, my little Smurfs! There must be a reasonable explanation for all of tonight's strange events. I think we're getting closer, Asriel. I can feel it. I can smell it. Smurf berries? We're right back where we started. No village and no Smurfs. I've been swindled. This fruit isn't magical. It's a fake, a fake, a fake, a fake. Are you suggesting that I traded you a fake flute? Oh, no. Oh, well, actually, I... This flute works perfectly. You just needed practice. Oh, well, of course. Then I'll practice until it's perfect. Play, wretched wizard! But, Painter, I didn't 
put my foot in your paint. And I didn't soak my head in it either. You did too. Did not. I did it too. Did not. Did it too. Did it too. Did it too. Look, Azriel, a miserable smurf. I think my luck is changing, Azriel. Uh, at least here in the beauty and the quiet of the forest, I can be alone. Uh, not quite alone, uh, miserable smurf. You'll have plenty of company. <laughs> <laughs> it works, Azriel. The flute works. I'm going to smurf painter a piece of my mind when I find him. Me too. That must have been Harmony. Even Harmony doesn't play that bad. I <laughs> got you, vile Smurfs. So, my rotten little Smurfs, we meet again. You're mean and nasty and terrible and horrible, Gargamel. <laughs> well, you say the nicest thing, Smurfette. <laughs> but tonight, I shall have all the Smurfs under my power. <laughs> Good night, Sloppy. Good night, Vanity. Good night, Greedy. Good night, Papa Smurf. Perhaps tonight I can smurf to the bottom of these strange events. What is that awful music? Huh? Greedy, where are you going? And where are you going, Jokey? Jokey Smurf, why aren't you asleep? My Smurf, he is asleep. Jokey, wake up, wake up. He's sleepwalking. It must be that music. And I think I know who the musician is. I must wake my little Smurfs. This should wake them up from their trances. Well, well what's this? Well, I can't let it go to waste. What? What? <laughs> Smurfing on! What am I doing here? Yeah, yeah, Listen, my little Smurfs. You have all been sleepwalking to the tune of a magic flute. Painter, Handy, and Smurfette have already disappeared. I suspect Gargamel's behind this, but we must make sure. Hefty, Lazy, and Jokey, come with me. We'll follow the music. And whatever you do, do not fall asleep. Yes, Papa Smurf. <sighs> <laughs> The music is smurfing from just up ahead. Be careful, my little smurfs. There they are. Take your hand and smurf that must be in that sack. Even great musicians need to rest, Hazriel. So, you give me a fake ruby, will you? will teach you not to give imitation rubies to Madame Trilby. Well, now, that is music to my ears. Last, my invention is complete. Only one thing remains, the final test. There, 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 my little pet. Not to worry, not to worry. First, the violet. So far, so good. Now the green. Excellent, excellent. Now, just a little drop of blue, and I'm the richest wizard in the world. Come on, come on. Don't just sit there, do something. Yes. 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 Do you know what this means, Azriel? Do you know what this means? I'm rich, rich, do you hear me? Now I don't have to catch six Smurfs to make gold. I only have to catch one and run him through my duplicating machine. <laughs> Sometimes I'm so clever. Hey, 
Smurf, Patty Smurf, Baker's Bay. Smurf me a cake as fast as you can. Oh, let's play a game. I hate games. I think that's an excellent idea, Smurfette. As Papa Smurf always says, playing games is a Smurfy way to exercise the mind. I hate exercise. I suggest a rousing game of pin the tail on the Smurf. Not bad. That's no fun. Uh, I always lose. How about bobbing for Smurf berries? I know a Smurfy game we haven't played in weeks. Hide and go Smurf. Yay! Great idea, Smurfette. Brainy, you're it. I'm always it. Smurf tag, I'm it. Ring around the Smurf berry bush, I'm it. Hide and go Smurf, I'm it. Hmm, I must be particularly talented in that area. Smurf 1000, Smurf 2000, Smurf 3000, Smurf 4000, Smurf 5000, Smurf 6000, Smurf 7000. I hope he doesn't buy me till bedtime. Smurf 9000, Smurf 10,000. Oh gosh, where can I hide? Allie, Allie, Smurfs and free! Gee, thanks, Happy. Hmm, this shouldn't take long. Uh, since I have uh, uh, no idea where I am, I think it would be safe to assume I'm lost. You're not lost. I found you. Don't worry, my little blue gold mine. After my treatment, you'll be as good as ever. Six times as good. <laughs> now comes magic time. First, the purple. Now for the green. And now, my babbling blue friend, in just a second or two, I, Gargamel the Great, will be able to take base metal and turn it into gold. Gold! Gold! Oh, Gargamel, you are so foolish. Everyone knows you have to have six Smurfs to make gold. Quite right. And thanks to my little invention here, in a few moments there will be six Smurfs. Six? <laughs> Why, that's plain impossible. If there's one thing I know, I know it can't be done. At least I didn't think so. What's all the excitement about? Oh, Baba Smurf, I'm so worried. We can't Smurf Brainy anywhere. He might be lost in the forest. Or hurt. Now, now, my little Smurfs, I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. He's probably still out Smurfing for you. But, Papa Smurf, we've been hiding for so long. Even Brainy could have found us. Well, we'll simply have to look for him. Oh, I'll fry a few and pickle a few and serve a few real cold. And I'll toast a few and roast a few and boil the rest for gold. Hey! Well, we better try to escape. Papa Smurf always says, I know what Papa Smurf always says. I know better than you do. Quiet! Quiet, you little monsters, or I might feed five of you to Osbriel and make six more of you. Oh, man! Oh, now where was I? Oh, yes, yes, a dash of ground toenail troll, a touch of pre-digested bat's milk, just a pinch of powdered unicorn hoof. Uh, let me see, uh, how much was it of the blech, sea serpent slime? A jug full. A jug full. A jug full! A jug full! You despicable little blue loudmouths! Look what you made me do! It's supposed to be a thimbleful! Now I'll have to get more! We were only trying to help! Well, I wasn't, neither was I. Silence, you insects! Azriel, keep an eye on these Smurfs. <laughs> And if you so much as touch one of them, I'll turn you into a doormat. I suggest we try to bend the bars. After all, I think a more scientific approach is called for. As Handy Smurf always says, with a keen mind and the right tool, anything is possible. <laughs> Let's make a run for it. This way, no, that way. Anyway. Brainy! Where are you? Brainy! Hmm. Brainy has been gone so long, even I'm beginning to get worried. Here he is, Papa Smurf! Oh, thank goodness. Brainy, where have... Oh, Papa Smurf! I Smurf Brainy! Wonderful, but... What's going on here? Oh, oh Papa, Papa Smurf! Smurf here's... here's... Oh, my! So, Gargamel has gone to get some more sea serpent slime. 
Yes, Papa Smurf. Well, it's a smurfy thing for you that you escaped. Now, we'll just have to see what my book has to say about this situation. I suggest you separate. Go stay with six different Smurfs while I work on this Smurfification problem. I think you should be more careful. You are really doing it all wrong. Oh, if I could make one small suggestion, you really should let me do it. After all, I am an expert, and one should always accept really good advice. As Papa Smurf always says... We can't go on meeting like this. I have gone over all my books, and I still cannot solve the problem of the six brainies. Uh... I know how you all feel. We have too many brainies. I hate too many brainies. I will have to study Gargamel's formula. And since I know the Smurf application machine is there, I'm going to have to take all six brainies with me. Hooray! We will leave immediately. There is no time to lose. Oh, oh blast those horrible little Smurfs. I always get so seasick out here. Ah, what a stroke of luck. Good luck, in fact. Usually, wherever you find sea serpent slime, there's sure to be a... Sea serpent! Help! I must read Gargamel's list of ingredients to find the antidote. Well, that shouldn't be too... As we are! Shh! Shh! Gargamel certainly is a sloppy fellow. I'm not sure I can read the whole formula. Hmm. Hmm. There is no missing ingredient. The secret to reversing the process is to multiply the ingredients by six and run you through the machine backwards. I should have known. One must not overlook the obvious. We're ready, Papa Smurf. Say when. Whenever you're... Oh, wait just a minute, my little uh, uh, brainies. There may be a slight drawback to my plan. Running the machine backwards may also cause it to blow up. Oh! But... It will only explode if too much dragon's breath is added. I wasn't scared. Oh, I knew it all the time. Me too. I... Quiet now, Brainies. I'm starting the machine. Maybe we should get off and help Papa Smurf. No, Brainy. I think I have a better idea. Get ready! Ah, oh, ah, oh, ah! Oh. We're starting to like each other. I don't know if we can... It's working! Naturally, I knew that it would. Brainy Smurf, it's nice to see you in one piece again. And serve a few real cold. And I'll toast a few, and roast a few, and boil the rest for gold. Hey, I have a Dazriel sea serpent slime. It's <gasps> Papa Smurf. Ah, oh, nice of you to visit, Papa Smurf. Now I can make 12 Smurfs and have twice as much gold. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> No! Azriel, what have you done, you stupid excuse for a cat? We let them escape. Ooh, I could kick myself. Oh, on second thought, or should I say third thought, with six of me, it would be six times easier to catch Smurfs. We would only have to catch one apiece. Why not make a hundred of me? A thousand! <laughs> Just think of it! A world full of me! What a world it will be! If you don't foul it up, if I don't foul it up, you've never done anything right yet. Well, that will all change now. You have to be very careful with this dragon's breath. I know that, you ninny. Who do you think invented this? You have to add exactly the right amount. One measured teaspoon. Exactly. <gasps> oh, oh, no! oh, I'll never dabble in duplication again. One explosion like this is enough. <clears throat> oh, no! And as I said to Papa Smurf, there is a great lesson to be learned from all of this. <laughs> yes, Brady, 
being faced by several grannies must have taught you a great deal about yourself. Oh, indeed, Papa Smurf. It has taught me that one brainy Smurf is not nearly enough to go around, while with more of me... 